Hey everybody, um, so a little bit of fusion work here, so let's work on doing um, the equivalent of plane cuts uh, and say slicing up models. Um, if you need to uh, do some modifications to STL files or bodies you've created or you know just a little a little uh, deeper into design. You know this is again more on the sort of beginner intermediate-ish side of fusion. Um, or if you've been doing it for a long time and you want to watch, great, there's more than one way it's going to get. Um, but again, we'll keep it short. You know, sort of short and sweet videos is what I'm going for. So I always say five minutes and you know, they end up being 20 or some crap, but um, we'll give it a shot. So, um, so plane cuts. Um, and really, in, uh, plane cuts in Fusion 360 are not called plane cuts, they're called uh, splitting bodies or splitting faces. And so when you um, create a body and you need to split it, slice it, um, or do a plane cut, eh, um, I'll show you how to do that. Uh, why don't we, um, instead of bringing in an STL, this will work if you bring in that STL file uh, in the other video that I showed you and then convert it to a, a mesh. Uh, this works too. doesn't matter. <clears throat> why don't we just do a quick one here. Let's do a create um, a sphere. And I'm going to put it right here on the, um, call it the, the bottom plane. Um, and we'll just do 40 is good. So now I've got this cool looking sphere, and uh, I want to cut it. I want to cut it in half. I don't like it. I don't like the way it looks at me. So um, there's a couple ways to do it. Uh, I found the easiest way to do it is to basically just sort of construct a plane that uh, sits away from it a little bit, draw a line vertically or horizontally, and slice that sucker, karate chop him right in half. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to turn my origins on so I get my little construction planes back. <clears throat> and I'm going to say construct and offset plane. Uh, and it's going to ask me, well, which plane do you want to use? I want to use this guy. And uh, so let me let me hide this body just so you can see a little bit. So I, I chose this plane, and now it's asking me, so how far away do you want to make it? So we know that that sphere we just made is 40 millimeters, um, and it just needs to be somewhere on the outside of it. So 20 is the radius. <clears throat> I'll go 30. Okay. Uh, and let's turn the body back on. So you can see my my plane is now over here. And it doesn't matter. It doesn't have to be, uh, you know, oh my gosh, Mark, it doesn't encompass that. It doesn't matter. You, you're, you've made a plane out in space. You may draw on it. You are allowed. Um, so I'm going to cut this guy vertically, and then I'm going to do uh, cut him horizontally. So uh, I'm going to sketch. I'm just going to do a one line, and I'm going to do it on this plane. And I uh, notice that my my construction plane that we just made just went away. I don't care. I know where I am. I'm just going to cut this dude right down the gut uh, on that green line. And I'm going to hit stop sketch. And so if we turn this thing around, you can see my line, even though it looked like we were drawing it on the part, is out in space. Right? I am um, 10 millimeters off the, the edge of this guy. Uh, and so now we're going to split. So the way you do a split plane is you go to modify. I'm sorry, split body. We're going to split the body this uh, body to split it's gonna right it walks you through it. it's pretty simple what body do you want to split uh, this guy what tool do you want to use to split the body well my tool is the line I just made so pick that pick your line and there you go it just slashed uh, my guy right in half it looks like Saturn hey look at that <clears throat> and now it's asking me do you want to do it so uh, yep and so now if you notice where I had one body now I have two Okay, and so let's hide this guy. So now I've got a little half moon, uh, half a burger, <clears throat> um, one half a hamburger bun, or a, a single butt cheek, however you want to do it. But now I want to cut them horizontally. And so we're going to do the same thing. I'm going to turn my little construction plane back on because it hides them uh, for whatever stupid reason. Um, <clears throat> but I'm going to, I want to cut it the other way now. So basically do this in a, in a quarter. Come on, let go. So we're going to do one more line, and I'm going to again choose this plane. And look at that, he disappeared. But I'm going to cut him right on the red line here. So I'm going to hover the red line, do that, end it, stop sketch. And you can see, again, my line is out in space because I did it on a space and plane. Plane in space. Ah, plane in space. Um, and we're going to do the same thing. Let's split body. Split body. Uh, which body? This one. Uh, splitting tool, that other line that we just made, hit OK, bang, 
and now it has cut this guy again. So now I have three bodies, three bodies. Oh, oh. So if we hide him, now we're just left with this quarter of the sphere that we originally made. So uh, pretty cool, right? Um, nice and easy. That's split bodies. And so now, I mean, you can get rid of these other ones if you don't want them. If you're just going to work on this going forward, um, but lots you can do with splitting planes, you know, splitting bodies, and splitting faces. You can split faces too, just using, <clears throat> you know, the face split versus the split body, or uh, and then there's a silhouette split. Um, so play around with those a little bit. But that's the easy little three minute. Here's how you split bodies. Um, so now you can bring in other portions of the design. You can merge different bodies together. Um, you can, let's say, uh, you know, add some features to this body, and then you can bring this body back, and you can mash them all together again by, um, you know, let's say I want to just do, I want to, I want to combine. I didn't, I didn't want to split that. I screwed up. Right? Let's call it that way. Um, you can either just do the back button, but let's say I added some features to it. Um, so you, you select them both, and then you come here and you combine. And now I'm back to the single body here. Uh, oh, it's, it's saying confirm, yep, confirm, keep it. So now I'm back down to two bodies, right? The original <clears throat> the original slice in half. So uh, anyway, hope it helps. Um, uh, we'll work on another one here in just a bit. Uh, thanks again, like, thumbs up, all that, uh, you know, all that good stuff.